Um, thanks for having me, everybody. Thanks very much. I've got to start with one quick thing, if you don't mind. Uh, I was struck by the fact, sitting here, looking at the sign that says, Kids Be Smart. Right there. It reminded me of the first time that Great Big C played in Toronto. Uh, and we were playing, and the font was exactly like it was. We were playing this place, I think it was called X Rays on Queen Street. I think there was like 26 people there. <laughs> 19 of them were cousins. <laughs> and, but still, we were playing in Toronto, so this is going to be awesome. And, and when we got to Queen Street, there wasn't, wasn't like a big neon sign, right? But it was one of them sliding signs, you know, like you might see in front of the Mary Browns or something. But the letters slid into the, to the thing, right? But it got windy between the sound check and the gig, and when we got there in the nighttime for the gig, two of the letters had blown out. So it said, tonight from Newfoundland, he big C. As my friends and father said, we're, <laughs> we're boots in the air, sir, way more popular than bats on the back. <laughs> <laughs> this is great, isn't it? Give a round of applause for the food. No, that's awesome. Okay. I'm very grateful uh, to be here and very grateful for everyone for coming out. Uh, I'm, I, I'm not surprised that it's a big house and that they're doing well. The first I heard about this whole thing was from from Paul and from Kim, and all, but I'll get to that in a sec. The, uh, I was on a board a little while ago for, uh, what's really the only board I've ever been on, yeah. And uh, for a, a charity called the Jackville House, Jackville Place. And uh, yes, thank you. And, uh, I was approached by John Steele to, to, you know, he said, told me about the charity and told me about the fundraising effort and how. You know, he wanted me to be involved, and I said, sure, man, we're doing a concert or a gig or something. He asked me, let's do it. He said, no, 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 I want you to be on the board. And I was like, what do you mean? <laughs> you be on the board. I was like, do I have to go to meetings? Sorry. He was like, yeah, you gotta go to meetings. But it was a great experience, and I became, really for the first time in my life, aware of the, uh, the generosity uh, that exists in Newfoundland and Labrador, and both, you know, from people's pockets and from people's time. And I've come to learn from Kim and Paul that, you know, that the heart and soul of this foundation and the whole Kids Eat Smart organization is really in all the volunteers. And even the volunteers who are here tonight are doing a great job. So give them a round of applause for all that. This is guilt-free celebration now. I mean, the thing is bad. <laughs> you can't afford not to drink and stuff here tonight. I mean, you got to have a good time or someone might start. Yeah, anyway, Kids Eat Smart uh, Foundation. Uh, or, what, what is it? Yeah, Kids Eat Smart Foundation. I remember when, I, when, when Paul asked me about the first... I was like, sure, it sounds cool, or whatever. And then I, I didn't know much about it. I just knew that if, if those guys were involved, then it would, it would be a good cause. And, it, and I, so I, I learned about it after I got on board, to be honest. And I was thrilled to, to see all the good work that they're doing all across the and Labrador. I'm grateful for that. Uh, I grew up, as most of you, I don't know if you know or not, but I'm from a small town called Petty Harbor, New Zealand. And, and uh, yes, thank you. And, uh, <laughs>
great thrill to be involved. So I'd like you to don't mind, can you give them a round of applause?